Hello everyone, my name is Evil Fusion, and today I will try and help you solve your problem with your headset not working in game slash microphone. And even though everything is correctly set up in your eyes, I will show you all the steps that you need to go through to make sure to, to make your headset work. You can follow these simple steps. It's not hard at all, just follow me if you're not familiar with all these steps. You will not do anything wrong, just follow what I do. I'm going to hit start here, we're going to go to settings. We're going to go to system. We're going to go to the left here. We're going to hit sound. We're going to look here as input device. You want to make sure and choose the right headset. If this is PC is just new or you just installed CFDs or you update your graphics driver or Windows updated or audio driver, it is known that this setting might have changed. So make sure this is a headset you're going to use or want to use it's equipped right. FYI, update you make sure you have a driver installed if it is exists of your headset. If not, ignore this. We're gonna choose the designated headset we want. For this scenario, this is an Astro A50. We're gonna choose this one. And as here you can see that's your microphone, this thing bulk is moving. It means it's notice my voice. Next up, we're gonna to go to sound control panel. We're gonna make sure that this is correct. As you can see, headset microphone, microphone Astro A50 voice is chosen as a default device, but default communication device is something different. For CFDs, I recommend, or like in general, recommend to have the headset you want to talk with in game to also choose this as a default communication device. To get to this, we hit on the headset we want, right mouse button, and we choose set as default communication device. Once you've done this, check it again. There is nothing else as a telephone green circle around. This is okay, hit okay. Next up, as you can see here, as what Windows set, and a lot of people have not read, is certain apps maybe set up to use different sound devices than the one selected here. See if these is really prone to this, and is, I don't know why, does this even though like you can see my settings for me are perfect CFT still doesn't pick up my mic I was this is why I struggle with so we're gonna hit this app volume and device preferences we are getting we see a list of programs that are running we're gonna launch CFTs now we're gonna like let us CFTs run and once CFTs opens we're gonna alt tap to come back so you hold Alt and Tap and you come back. And as you can see, Sea of Thieves is in this list now. But as you can see, Sea of Thieves is chosen default. This is super important because Sea of Thieves does not properly work when this is put to default. I have no clue why it is buggy and I have never understand why not because I chose the right, perfect, correct headset that works. But Sea of Thieves apparently doesn't want to use it. So... We're going to choose here, top one is for the output, so we choose what you want as output. I recommend doing this, this is for the future because this will never change even though you update drivers and stuff. This will, not, this will always apply and stay the same unless you lose your headset, uninstall programs or you're not, or you got a new headset. Change this to the new headset obviously. Next up is the input device. This is why your headset is not working in game. You're going to choose the right headset that we use. In my case, the Astro 50 A50 voice. We make sure this is like this. If you've chosen the right one, you can close this window and we can go to Sea of Thieves. Now we go in Sea of Thieves quickly and we go check if the settings are right. What I also recommend once you're in Sea of Thieves, hit Windows G. Open up Game Bar. This might be new for some people, might be not. Normally, you should have this voice or audio thing window open. If not, just hit it up here. Just hit the icon with the audio and it pops up. So we're going to go to voice. We're going to look if this is correct. Windows default input is headset microphone A50, Astro A50 voice. Really important. This, this is why I tell you this needs to be the same. This is what CUFT likes to use. If this is, if you did not do what I said, then you will see a different microphone here. Leave this on the same headset as this one that you're using. If this is correct, just hit the middle of the window somewhere else where there's nothing of this and the Windows game bar closes. 
now we're going to go ahead settings because a lot of times CFTs and like when you just launch it or just install it, CFTs is on push to talk. CFTs is on this. So your headset will not work at all. It's like you will not be able to talk. If you want to keep this, you can change this in the keyboard and mouse section and look, look for push to talk. You need to scroll down, look for push to talk and just change it there. But for now, I'm just going to, you can also put this on toggle. And you just hit it once and you open your mic, you hold it and hold, or you turn it off. In this case, I'm going to leave it off. What I also recommend, you don't need to leave this on, turn on player chat indicator. Once you've done this, let's launch the game quickly and launch into the server. Because we cannot see in here that the headset is properly working. This is all still a gamble for us. Like we do not get feedback from the game that this headset is properly working for us. So we want to launch... Like, want to launch a game, just use a simple ship, doesn't matter what, and just go in. Or join your friends, it's all the same, just get in the game, in a server, and let's find out if it works. If you follow the steps correctly, as I did, and as I tell, told you, and you have not updated your drivers, or audio drivers, or anything, in the meanwhile, then your headset should 100% work in here. As you can see in the top right corner, I have a green chat, chat bubble. This, in, this indicates my microphone is in-game picking up, like CFT picks my microphone up. If I'm going to be quiet for a minute, you will see the green chat bubble will go away. So this indicates, as you can see I'm talking, indicates that CFT is perfectly picking up my headset as I wanted to. And I have can finally chat with people in-game. You can now turn the indicated chat bubble off if you want. I do not recommend this though, because otherwise you don't have feedback in case it doesn't work again like later because you did a Windows update and you forgot about it. So yeah, I hope this helps you all a lot, a lot, a lot and this solves your problem why your headset is not working. If this does not solve your problem, do not be shy or feel annoyed to ask me questions. Just leave me a comment. I'll try to hit you up in Discord, even potentially with TeamViewer. To help you sort your stuff out so you can enjoy sea of these at its fullest and can chat with people in game if you want to. If this helped you out and your friend struggles with this, you can share this video, you don't need to. I hope okay. share this video as much as you want to the people who ask. I really hope this solves your problem and I hope you can full, fully enjoy sea of these with random players now and then and the funny encounters you can have. Other than that, I wish you a lot of fun in sailing, and I hope to catch you around on the seas, and I hope you have fun. Love you all, bye, and catch you on the seas. Have fun, pirates.